Hey guys, I'm not Clay. Um, I'm his wife, Stephanie, if you've not met me. Um, he asked me, he's been asking me for a few days to pop on here and do a minute ministry video, so I finally said why not. Um, and something I want to talk about today is love. I was listening to Clay's video from earlier this week, and he was talking about our daughter, Reagan, and how she has learned um, to say, you know, I love you, Daddy, I love you, Mommy, and she's expectant of a response. That really spoke to me. That really blessed me. Thinking about love, it's not just a noun, it's a verb, and it's an active verb. Um, and our daughter has learned with saying I love you that an expression of love is something that um, prompts a response. And she is expectant that there's going to be a response there. And it had me thinking about the love that we have between us and the Lord. Um, you know, we're told that we love him because he first loved us. You know, and he first loved us, and our response to him is to love him with our lives, with everything that we've got. Um, and just to think about, you know, the people that you might know that think that being a Christian means acknowledging the Lord and accepting Jesus as your Lord and Savior, taking him into your heart, and then you've got your ticket into heaven. And just thinking about how much we're, those people might be missing or we might be missing in that relationship when we really... Our love toward God is an active thing, that we are actively seeking his heart, learning more about ourselves through learning more about who he is, learning more about what he has planned for our lives and just the richness that comes with that obedience and that faith and that action, love being an active verb. Um, but I also think it goes the other way too, that you know God's love towards us is active. It is not that... He, he created us. He loves us. He watches us from on high. Um, in Luke 11, it says that, you know, we as men know how to give good gifts to our children. And how much more does our Father in heaven give good gifts to those who ask of him? And so just, I encourage us this, this, you know, today, this week to remember that God's love for you is active too. That he is actively with you in all those times and all the seasons and in the, the, the mountaintops and the valleys, you know, you might be going through um, big changes. Clay and I are already getting ready to have our second child, and there's a lot of things that we're uncertain about of how our life is going to look. But through it all, we know that God is actively working with us and working for us. So I just encourage you today to, you know, smile about that. Remember that. Whatever your day might hold, remember that God's love for you is there. And it is helping you through, and it is active. And I pray that your response to him is something that's active as well. Thanks for taking a minute.